Hi, I'm going to review today Stuff, S-T-U-F. It's basically a um, clipboard program. So instead of just having your regular clipboard, which basically all you do is copy something and paste it once, you, you reboot your computer, shut down, it's gone. With Stuff, it remembers what you copy. It sits up here with this little S icon. It doesn't... <coughs> It doesn't show up down here as it just get in your way as you don't need to open it very often. It just sort of sits nicely in the background. You can do a quick copy here, a quick paste. So easily paste straight into a field wherever you have open. You've got your preferences. Show hide quickly. That basically gets open as well. Privacy mode, which it probably isn't useful to most people, but maybe if you're running a business that might be handy about check for updates and that's it so if we just go to pre uh, no, if we go to show and hide this is the main interface as you can see not a lot going on here because I haven't actually copied anything yet but down here you can search your clipboards but I don't have any to search you can get your preferences here I'll just show you preferences while I'm here here on preferences you can enter a name that you want to be displayed when you share because you can share your clipboards with multiple computers add an optional note or set a hotkey on your keyboard to open to open stuff usage highlight color, background color, text color make it completely invisible which is a bit pointless or, or completely visible you can show on start, start on start up or not. All sorts of other options such as show uh, usage tips on clipboard items. Copy into selected clipboard. Display shadow on the text of the item. Number of clipboard entries in menu, and default to post in uh, in plain text only. Advanced. How many clipboard items per stack size? 20 by default. Use fixed port range for sharing. So if you're sharing, you can set up your ports. Or do not look for network clipboards. So very simple preferences really there. Close that. Next you have this icon that looks like a pencil. Click that. It's to create a new clipboard. You can also choose whether to share it on the network. You can set your name, such as System Clipboard or Clipboard 2, whatever. You can share it with your network, and if you do, you can password protect it or not. You can export it. Next, we have Minus and Plus. This basically does the same thing, it adds. But it adds by hitting the plus or delete by hitting delete. I can't delete that because it's the only one and, and it's just a system one. And refresh. Very, very basic interface, but that's all you need. Of course, you can also resize. Let me demonstrate by opening, let's say, Chrome. Okay, I have a website open here. And let's just copy any text we find. Let's say this is a little bit of text here. Copy to clipboard. Now that flash blue the icon for stuff. So we can open it and see it right here. What if you go to quick paste? It's there as well, or you can delete all items. Now let's go here to the search box, go here and click. There it is, it's been added and pasted back into wherever you want to paste it. Very quick and simple. So if you go here and you go back to the center stuff, you can see your clipboards and you can say this item here is what we just copied with a number one there. If we select it, 
You can press I to edit the item's title. That little information button. This little X here deletes. As you can see, press Shift Enter to restore the clipboard. So that just puts it to this little system clipboard so you can copy and paste it. Paste it anytime. Or just hit Enter straight away to paste it right away into whatever like field you have selected. Or like I say, you can delete it here. Close your window here. Of course, you can view your about box, version 1.55, which is the latest at the time of making this video. And check for updates. Stuff also has quick look. So if you have a uh, picture or something copied, you can just hit spacebar like you would in a uh, finder and you can have a quick look at your document. So that is a quick review of Stuff. Stuff is a very basic program but it does the job. It remembers the stuff you copy even when you close the program and reopen it. This can come in useful to say, for say on YouTube. Quite often when I make a comment on a video on YouTube and, pay, uh, and hit enter, it doesn't actually do it. Sometimes it just refuses to submit the comment. And then you've lost your comment because you can't seem to select it again to copy and paste it. Well with stuff, all you have to do is type it out copy it, then it's saved. Then, if you lose it, you can always paste it, even if you've gone to another site in the meantime and copied something else. So it comes in very handy for especially long text you may have copied and for whatever reason you need again. So yeah, it's definitely a very handy program to get for £12.99. Definitely worth getting, and it's very basic and unintrusive as it just sits up here in the menu bar. So thanks for watching, this is a review for videotechreviews.com. Please rate, comment and subscribe.